Hi, I'm here with Anthony from Signal Transformer. And uh, we've got some toroidal inductors here in front of us that we're going to talk about. Anthony, when, there's a variety of these things available from different okay. manufacturers. When you have to select a toroidal inductor, what are the things you need to worry about? Well, first and foremost, uh, you need to establish which product will give you the greatest energy storage capability. In addition to that, you're looking for a unit with the lowest temperature rise and possibly the uh, lowest DCR. In addition to that, you're looking for a unit that is capable of differentiating or splitting up the frequencies for your application. In other words, since this is going to be a filter application, you're looking for a unit that's going to pass certain frequencies and reject others. You have some examples here. Can you take us through those? Certainly. Um, this is our new series of high current toroidal inductors with inductance ranges anywhere from 10 microhenry to 1,000 microhenry current capacity from 2.4 amps to approximately 20 amps, and a operating temperature of minus 55 to 105 degrees C. These units have great energy storage capacity due to the distributive gap in the core material. Uh, in addition to that, they are equipped with uh, the lowest current density since we're utilizing the heaviest copper possible to have the lowest copper losses. What do you find to be the typical applications for these? These are mainly used in EMI R5 filtering applications. Well, that's, uh, that's good stuff, Anthony. Thank you. Well, you're welcome, sir.